Let's change the background image. If you hover the cursor over the section, you'll see these icons on the top left. Click on this icon to edit the background media. Make sure you don't accidentally click on the same icon that appears on the title image that we've previously added. We're only changing the section background. Again, let's drag and drop our background image for wide screens here and make sure you follow the recommended dimensions, 2560 by 1440 pixels. Now take a look at the image preview. This box right here is the approximate safe area, the part of your image that won't be cropped out regardless of the screen size. So make sure the important parts of your image stay within that area. Let's enter some alt text. And for tall screens, the recommended dimensions are 1080 by 1920 pixels. If I use the same image here, sometimes it does work, but other times it may end up being cropped or pixelated. I've already tested this image and I can confirm that it works well for tall screens too, so there's no need to create another image for mobile. Click Save Changes, and you may notice that the image is a little bit dark. That's because there's an overlay on top of it, and you can remove it by clicking on the Section Options icon next to the Section Preview on the left, and then decreasing the overlay all the way to 0%. In the next video, we will explore all these options and settings that will affect the whole title section.